Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Rulings regarding prayer. Rukua, part one. One of the obligatory parts of prayer which is performed in every rak'ah after qira'ah is ruku'. Ruku' is one of the rukns of prayer. Therefore, if one forgets to perform it or they perform it more than once in one rak'ah, whether intentionally or inadvertently, their prayer will become invalid and they must perform it again. But if they remember that they have not performed ruku' before placing their heads on turba for the second sajda, in that case, they should stand up and perform ruku' and then proceed with the rest of the prayer. Bending forward for ruku' must be performed by making the intention of ruku' and if worshippers bend forward with another intention, their ruku' is invalid. Worshippers should bend forward for ruku' to the extent that they can put the palms of their hands on their knees and obligatory precaution even demands that the palms are placed on their knees during ruku'. And if worshippers perform their prayer in sitting position, they should bend forward for performing ruku' to the extent that it is conventionally considered to be ruku'. Ruku' must be performed in all prayers, and if one finds it difficult to perform, they should observe the following rules. 1. If possible, they should lean on something and then perform ruku'. 2. If they cannot do so, they should bend forward as much as they can. 3. If they cannot bend forward at all, they should perform ruku' in sitting position. 4. If they still find it impossible to do, they should indicate it with the head while standing. 5. But if they cannot even indicate with the head, they should close their eyes by making the intention of performing ruku' and recite the dhikr and then open their eyes by making the intention of rising from ruku'. The rest of the issues pertaining to ruku' will be explained in the next episode. Institute for Compiling and Publishing the Works of Ayatollah Makarem Shirazi